craft, I suppose. This is Trini, Trini the Bulldog. If you look closely, you can see in Trini's left eye what's known as a cherry eye. It's quite common, not desirable. Trini's been playing quite roughly with her sister and this can be the result of it. Um, if left, it will swell and you'll need the attention of a vet who can either cut it out. Um, this can be done under uh, sedation which is a preferable way rather than full anaesthetic and you should expect to pay probably somewhere around 50 or 60 pound for that operation to be done. Some people uh, are led to believe that you can stitch it back in or I believe this is one of the procedures but it, it does seem to be a little bit haphazard and, and it may involve having to have it done again and then ultimately um, being cut out anyway. Another method is trying to pop it back in yourself, which is what we're going to demonstrate here. Um, how old is Trini, Maria? Three months. She's three months old. Normally, these cherry eyes, if they pop out, come out at quite an early age, earlier than this, and, and you know, so it's uh, sometimes uh, the, the older they are, the easier it is to do. Now, what we're going to do is Maria's going to put her thumb just in the corner of puppy's eye and she's going to roll the bottom eyelid over the cherry and then she's just going to mas massage it gently back into the corner uh, uh, of Trini's eye. So she's going to roll the bottom eyelid over with the tip of her thumb and she's just gently going to rub, massage it down into the corner of her eye and you should find that this will um, make cherry pop away. Um, it it's, may well come out again, hopefully it won't, um, we don't think it will, and uh, Maria's just going to show you now. So just roll over and then gently massage down. There we go, cherry gone. If the cherry's been out for a long while, you may find that the eye looks a little bit swollen or, or a little bit bruised in the corner there. And, um, it, you know, that, that shall settle down after puppy's had a, had a little sleep. So, there you go. Trini's not going to the vet today. No surgery. And, and like I say, some of it, sometimes a lot of fuss about nothing. So, before you rush off to the vet, don't sit there looking at it. Just have a little go yourself. Just roll up in the corner and just gently massage it down. Good girl. We'll be getting another cherry away in a minute.